Hey everybody, welcome back to Tomb Raider. We've uh, found this small town, which is a cool little outpost area. Whoa. Uh, there is some problems with this guy who I guess is a leader in this area named uh, Omar and basically threatened this other guy that he was gonna put his son to work if he didn't find a replacement. And so what I'm doing is I'm going to look for his son who I think is back we head out in this general area, this is where the sun is supposedly located. So I'm going to go look for him. No, vienen muchos turistas por aquí. Oh, no I'm I can not imagine. A tourist. I mean, I'm a researcher. Ay, de todos modos, ojalá hubiese visto este lugar hace 20 años. En auge, vibrante, lleno de vida y de optimismo hacia el futuro. <sighs> Optimista. Más como crédulo. What happened? Por venir fue lo que pasó. Una petrolera grande fuera de Lima. Okay, so we've heard Vinieron, por venir a few times a gente, now. Les dieron trabajo a todos. Incluso iban a construir condominios al otro lado del río. <laughs> Hasta que todo se vino abajo. The oil crash. Ahora nos arrastramos en las obras que dejaron. Lástima que no sea turista. Ellos traen dinero. Oh, Los savage. Los investigadores se lo llevan. <laughs> Whoopsie. Never mind, I'm a tourist. Okay, so we have this dock here, but we truthfully want to be on that side of things, I think. We'll see what this guy has to say. Este pueblo estuvo una vez bajo el ala y la atención del cóndor. Pero dejamos que el águila lo ahuyentara. I'm not sure I understand. Yo tampoco. Nos perdimos en nuestra búsqueda. Pensé que seríamos más felices con monedas en los bolsillos. Pero el águila también se llevó eso. Wow, sorry, man. We've got an eagle in this area, next to where we need to be at. Some of our chats are a little bit more abstract, but either way. Yeah, this is definitely where we want to be. Nunca lo había visto por aquí. I just got in, but I won't be staying long. Que la apariencia no te engañe. Es un buen lugar. Difícil, pero bueno. Your garden seems to survive the storm. Suerte y trabajo duro. Mucha gente ayudó en la siembra, así que también quieren protegerlo. <laughs> That's one of the nice things about a place like this is you really get that sense of community, if for no other reason than necessity, right? You. There was a monolith. What is that? That we ran it. Oh, is this the kid? Oh my god. Ayuda, por favor. Are you okay? Me perseguirán. Are you Pablo? Si. Sí. It's okay. Your father sent me. He's at Abby's. Go now. Go meet him there. I'll take care of these guys. Gracias. Muchísimas gracias. Aww. Get out of here. Enter the crypt. What the that hell? Good. No, it doesn't. All right, here we go. Buckle up. Jeez. What the hell got into him? He used to bring us ten people a week. You ask me, it's that brother. It's always unionization this and justice that. Wow, wow, wow. Fucking snowflake. Oh yeah, you want to talk snowflakes, bitch? Are the fines here You're my special people? snowflake. On the black market. True. Almost 100% markup. Whatever we get for them. Oh, back in the trees. All right, let's just see. There, I see three of them. If I go up here, I don't really like that position. I think I can take this guy. Stupid fucking thing. I just don't know if 
The other dude's gonna patrol this way. The generator's broken. Oh. Okay, so I don't really want to grab these all the time. It's good to know that we can, but... Are there others here, though? Reddish vines sometimes found in the Amazon's canopy used for healing. Cat's claw. So I guess if we wanted to make an all-out brawl here, we could have. With these, uh, little grenades or what have you. Another one. No nos quedaremos sin hacer nada. Esto fue la gota que derramó el vaso. Más les vale que lo dejen ir ahora mismo. Sus armas no los protegerán más. Oh, I thought I would just throw it down because they had the gun aimed at them. Now, do they know exactly where I am? Cover me. I'll check it out. Eyes on target. Engage. Wow. That's cool. I think it's worth breaking cover for that. I think she's gone. Oh, is that right? You think she's gone? So, do you see how that second thing was up there? I thought maybe that would indicate that we could take them both down because of that skill that we upgraded previously. But I think I needed to wait a little bit more and we might see the icon on both or something. Or maybe it was like... If we had been... If we had taken down the guy behind first and we could have chained it into the, to the second. We'll have to experiment with that a little bit more. But we saved these guys. Sorry to be uh, traumatizing. You guys Gather good? Your things, I go back to the village. Do I have to tell all of you this? Now would be good. I'm just seeing if there's anything else around here that we can grab. Hello. A Tumi knife, Incan sacrificial knife. This knife is a cheap plastic replica of those traditionally used to sacrifice llamas in the Inti Raimi or Sun God Festival. It was Why also occasionally llamas? used to perform trepanning surgery. The Inca believed that cutting a hole in the skull could relieve pressure to cure some diseases. So that's kind of linked to that other thing we saw about the deformed heads. And then people in the comments were pointing out that they would do that uh, on, like, children because their skulls are more malleable right after birth, which that part's obvious. But why anyone would ever do that? Pfft. Jesus. Who knows? Oh. Assuming this is a way out. Oh, I've got a link here. Where do I want to go to? I guess this area is fine.
problem solved. Did I take all of this stuff that I could? Now, what's going to happen when that Omar dude finds out that we helped this guy? That's the real question. Oh, this is so disgusting. I'm also curious as to what would have happened had we come out of here or went into that area before actually talking to these guys. Well, I guess it's anybody's. This is where the Omar guy was. I'm gonna go back to the where the father was at at the bar. There he is, and Pablo's there too. Nice. Hope everything's cool. Pablo me dijo lo que hizo. No, no sé qué decir. Solo gracias. Of course. Hace muchos años, cuando mi abuelo era niño, vinieron unos hombres que querían talar en los alrededores de la aldea. Todos tenían miedo de enfrentarlos, menos mi abuelo. Un muchacho de 15 años, con un arma vacía, defendió la aldea e hizo que hombres que lo doblaban en tamaño regresaran por donde habían llegado. Sometimes the courage of one person can outweigh the cowardice of dozens. Aún tengo el arma que él llevaba entonces. Quiero que la conserve como símbolo oh, wow. de valentía y de mi gratitud. You sure? Don't you want to give that to Pablo? Mi pequeño quiere ser doctor como su mamá. ¿Y usted cómo es que se llama? Lara. Ya tengo una nueva historia para contar, Lara. Gracias. <laughs> Doesn't have to be a shotgun, does it? No, but I'll take it. So we're going to save the skill point. The reason I said shotgun was because... Um, this crypt entrance requires a shotgun to get into, but for now we're going to head up and we're going to meet up with uh, Jonah, hopefully. And can I grab... Yeah, let's grab this eagle, I guess, when we're over here, too. Okay. That's a cool little sentiment that he gave us, actually. The fact that the weapon, like, means something. Uh, but also helps us is a nice touch. There's our merchant. So this should be where the eagle is too, right? Like right in this area? But I don't know if it's like... We have to do something special to find it. I'm sure we'll be back in here, so. A lot bigger on the outside. What'd you do? <laughs> Trying to look. It's missing a piece. Ye shall and shack shall. The twins come together. That's from the photo, I think, right? What is it? Laura, I... What? Abby said <laughs> not to break anything. I'm not breaking it. I'm restoring the original. Someone was trying to hide it. Ugh. 
The twins come together before following the path of the living. It's been tampered with. Like that thing in Mexico. This must lead to the next clue. Go. I'll stay here. See what else I can find. <sighs> Sounds good. That would be my answer to everything she wants to do. Like, you go ahead. I'll be here just like watching our backs. Meeting chicks at the bar. Well, that's something I need to know how they would build. Like these pressure sensitive doors, once it feels like something's open, they're just gonna take care of it themselves. Life and death. Jonah, I found the temple. Whoa. Great. Damn. Trinity found the temple too. Trying to blast their way in. I'm gonna take a closer look. They're so subtle. Path of the Living. Swan dive. Press jump and then seek. Oh, cool. Always something going on under here. I'm actually full of gadgets. Should maybe upgrade something next chance we get. Name carries a lot of weight with this group, as you can imagine. Drones were unexpectedly heavy and sharp. Boat looks okay, though. I'm glad you're here. We have a problem. Jenny again? I'm on it. What or who is Jenny? She wants us to search underwater? She wants us to search everywhere. Obviously, we've been missing something this whole time. Okay. So, what are we going to do? We're going something better. What? How the hell are we gonna deal with that? Oh no! Okay, so we're full up on all this. You know why? Because we haven't been able to reach them. Man, this is Dock Station, Operation Lone Wolf on. Okay, so I need to get back over in this area. Anyway, drones have been launched. What? Five miles down there. Okay, so it's not near us. I'll let you know if they find anything. Oh. We don't have any openings on this side though, it's a problem. On me! Damn it! I don't think you guys saw anything. I imagine I could probably pull some of these guys into the water if I'm careful, but... Get out here! Okay, so there aren't too many of them. Oh, 
Oh, cool. We just gotta be real close. That is awesome, actually. Oh, oh wow, you shouldn't let me do this. Oh, don't worry. I'm not worrying at all. Whoa. So he's right here. <laughs> I kind of like that they see him, too. They can shoot me all they want. Uh oh. Never mind. I don't like that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm like stalking my prey here. But they they know I'm here, so it's like even more terrifying. They just see their friends going down one by one. Okay, he's at the edge of the dock. Oh, I had it. How freaked out would you be? Pretty. That's how. Yeah, go check. Go check the dock. Press Q to activate survival instincts. Enemies highlight in red are visible. Yeah, we I mean we probably could have done that there. Do you have any do you who I am? I'll just get right over there. This is so cool. Obviously, it'd be nice to do this completely silently, but... In a way, it feels a little bit more, like, murdery. <laughs> in a... In a nice way. Got him! Oh, that's so cool. I think we have that upgrade where we automatically loot from the guys we stealth kill too. Which for this kind of stuff is really helpful. I don't have enough space for that. Do I need to heal or are we good? We're good. Laura, you okay? Yeah, there's a Trinity base here. Better than ever, buddy. <laughs> Oh no, she's gonna be pissed. Hey, Abby, I can explain. I'll get back to you later, Laura. Don't do anything crazy. Don't do anything crazy, he says. All right. Still, if they're here, they're ahead of us. So we have three points now. At least it means I'm on some sort of track. Breath capacity is nice. Is right, and the sun is dying. I have to get to that box before he does. Okay, so let's do breath capacity. And... Reveal challenge objects while using survival instincts. Maybe the rare animals could be good. Actually, let's just, let's do a swimming speed. Yeah, that'll work. 
And let's get a couple of our upgrades in here. I'd really like to do this one, but we're going to need to find those wolves, which we haven't seen at all. Uh, but that will, that'll totally be my jam. That's something we'll probably wear for quite a while. I almost wonder... I think I'm going to switch back to this one, too. Enemies take longer to detect us and identify us as a threat. Uh, within here, let's upgrade the bow. Let's do reinforced limbs, so more damage. And we'll do faster draw speed. Rate of fire. Weapon upgrade level 4 we need there. Okay, and then some more pelts. I'm just looking at the difference here. So the Riverhawk looks like it's a bit better. This is the one that we have available. So the Riverhawk does more damage, but this one's more accurate and has a higher rate of fire. Seeing as it's not something I'm going to use a lot, I think I'm okay with this. If I'm going to if I'm going to get into a firefight, I'll probably use these ones. Let's increase rate of fire here. And extended mag never hurt anybody. Wait, was there something else showing on there? Oh, it's actually showing which part. That's cool. And because these use different things, like, we actually maxed out on these bolts previously. So we could probably... If we get to this next level, or, oh, we actually need this powder, it looks like. Because we could augment the accuracy and rate of fire to, to make this even better, but let's just boost its damage a bit. And the extended mag. And the reload speed. I can do second level extended mag as well. Why not? Yeah, cool. Now we're, like, pretty jazzed up. It's looking good. Okay, cool. I think this might be a good place to take a break. Uh, when we come back, we'll obviously carry on down this path. And I'll probably start hunting some things as well when we're in more of the open, foresty areas. Um, just for all the hides and all the other resources that come with that. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you soon, okay? Bye for now.